Hi, hello and welcome to autopostingtools.com. Uh, today I want to show you what is the installation process for the software. So the first thing that you will be doing in this case is going through the going through the website and then basically you will see the tutorials to see if you like that specific module or not and learn how to use it. Once you went through all the tutorials, there is 70 tutorial 72 uh, modules working right now. You can just go here on pricing or just scroll down, which basically is going to take you to the same place. So basically, you will make your payment for $10 or for $135. Um, this $10 is for a trial of uh, five days for $10. And then after that is $43 every month. So once you make your payment, basically, you will get an email with JBSU. Uh, you will just fill out the information that you have here. So you will fill out your email and you will fill out uh, your PayPal. And basically, you will just make your checkout. Once you make your checkout, you will be able to get this window. Uh, basically, uh, JBSU will send you an email that is going to take you to this window. In this window, basically, we thank you for your purchase and then you will have to fill out this. So here you will fill out your name. In this case, I will just put any name. Um, Luis Perez. So this is Perez. This is your name. This is so I know who you are. The PayPal email is just basically to check your payment. So you could just do any 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 email. Basically, this also is going to send you an email telling you the information about uh, your username and password just like a reminder then you have to select the subscription type which in this case is the lifetime or the monthly subscription so this is for me to be easier to check your payment then you choose a username in this case i'm going to choose demo one and i'm going to choose demo one as a password then it asks you for the year, so you just put the year that we are now, which is 2017. And here, basically, it asks you for um, extra features that you would like to be added. So basically, you could put support for proxies, which most of the modules already does, but it's just an example. So once you do this, basically, you will click the button create an account. You will get an email on your account and then you will get this information here. So here, this is the login information for the software, which is going to say my username and my password. I'm going to save this information. The next thing you will see is basically this video that's going to show you how to install it. And here you see the download instructions. So first you watch the tutorial, then you have to download the software. Then you have to install the MySQL Express. And then you can watch the tutorials to see how to, how to work with the software. And finally, if you decide to get our um, software development course, uh, you could get it there. So now um, here we're going to click on the red button that says download. That is going to open up and it's going to open Mediafire. In this case, it's going to open Mediafire. Sometimes if you get many ads on the sites, uh, basically, that's basically advertisement from Mediafire. You can install something called Adblock, and basically that is going to allow you to remove all that advertisement. So you click on the button Download, and basically uh, you choose Save File. So you click on OK. This is going to open the file and it's going to save it on your uh, Downloads folder, or you could just move it to a different folder. In this case, I have WinRAR installed on my computer, so it's going to open with WinRAR, but I will just open it the, usually the same way as anyone would without WinRAR. The reason for this is because probably you don't have WinRAR, and then I don't want you to have problems of not being able to install it. So what you do is you select the folder, Auto Posting Tools, this is a zip file, you right click on it, and then you select open with and you click Windows Explorer. This is going to get you this specific window. In this case, uh, you will see that these are uh, links and these are folders. 
the, in this case the most important folder will be this one which it contains all the software files so in order to be able to install it what you do is basically you just select that and drag it and drop it in your desktop so once you do that you can close this you don't have to uh, use this anymore and here you will have this folder in this folder basically you will see the main files for the software the software that we're going to be using or the or the file that we are worried about is this one auto posting tools um, that exe uh, it says here application and it's about uh, four to five uh, megabytes in this case you can see here four four point eight kilobytes thousand kilobytes so what you do is just right click on this you click send to and you select the desktop this will create this file here this this shortcut so you can run the program from here okay so now that we have the program from here uh, basically i will just explain a little bit more what it's inside these folders here we have the auto clicker this one it's for um, like converting videos and adding watermarking here whenever you are posting the images will be downloaded here so you could remove those uh, other important thing is for you will be to read the manual uh, for the auto posting which it contains many useful information about the software uh, here you will save the program will save your profiles for Craigslist, for QGG for Backpage and for other ones uh, here you have some samples for proxies so this is your samples you have to create your own list and here on the SQL attach database this is where your ads will be stored in this case uh, the software uses these files to store information and to read it and we're going to install a server that is going to allow us to read this information here on the video output whenever a, a video is converted uh, it's going to be saved here and here you can see support files in this case these files are going to help you out in some cases for example this one if you are running some files you, and you need to have the latest version of the internet explorer on the on the rendering you will run this file and so on so here you have different things that can help you so now that I explain you more or less what these uh, folders are all about uh, we're going to continue installing the software in this case we double click on this this is going to tell you that the publisher is not verified that you want to continue you click run so now this is going to open this window where it's going to ask me for my username and my password that I previously created in this case you can see that here on the top is going to be my username and password and basically I'm going to type it there demo1 and demo1 so this is going to allow me to open the software and to log in, in the software however I also get a pop-up that it says that my SQL exp Server Express has not been installed in this case this uh, file is for being able to read the information on the database so I had to install this so I can interact with the database so basically to install it I just click on the button here and this is going to start downloading it it's going to download on my computer or basically you have the other option to download it from here based on your computer most of the time I uh, if your computer has more than 4 gigabytes of RAM then it's going to be 64 otherwise it's going to be 32 bits and basically when you click the button it's the same thing as if you were clicking this other button it's going to open up and it's going to download it for you so here it's being downloaded so here it's going to uh, download it I click on run to run the file and then I just click next I click accept I click next I click install it asks me if I want to allow this installation I click yes and it's going to install it for me so this has finished installing now because it's been installed I close this and now I'm able to log in 
I could either close it and open it again or I can just click login. So as you can see, I'm able to log in and I'm able to use all the different modules on the software. Uh, the most important one, just to check that everything worked out, you select Craigslist and you select Craigslist to posting. So this is for you to check that the installation process went well and that you can read the information on the database. The way you can see is because you will see this window and you didn't got any error. Also, whenever you click new add, you will see the location of all the different uh, cities that we have on the software. You have over 200 cities, to over 250 cities that are already there. If they, if you, if you, if you, if your city is not here, then watch the video about how to add it, uh, the city on on your on your on your software. So as you can see, this is already ready for you to start using. So you can use it. You have uh, if you go here on help and you click video tutorials, this is going to take you to the video tutorials of all the softwares. Also, our important thing that you should know is that whenever you open a module, like for example, the yellow page scraper, you have this big button that says tutorial. When you click that button, that is going to open up a video that is going to explain you how to use that specific module. So if you have many software, each one is going to have a different uh, button there so you can watch the tutorial and see how that specific module works. So I thank you again for um, buy, for buying the software. Uh, we are almost uh, finished. So the next part will be to watch the tutorials, which is basically what I did show you now. You can click help and you can click video tutorials or you can click the button right here. That is going to take you to the tutorials that you could see and you can start posting with uh, the software. So the one I would suggest you to watch next if you're going to start uh, posting with Craigslist will be this one, how to start posting with Craigslist as the posting software. So with this, uh, you are ready, ready to start working. So the only thing that I will uh, tell you uh, at last will be that if you want to make money, use the software, but also uh, you can get our training about how you can create your own software business. In case this, um, this course will teach you everything that you need to know about how to start your own software business and basically uh, start uh, making more money online. Because uh, one thing is using our system, which is going to make you money, that's for sure. But other thing will be having your own product and having people to work for you and build you some uh, income. So if you want to get it there, you can just basically click here on the software development success and it's going to take you to softwaredevelopmentsuccess.com and from there you can just watch uh, what we offer and if it interests you, you could get it and buy it and basically you can learn all that. So thank you for watching how to install the software. Uh, I hope you like it and if you have any question, uh, you can always contact me on the support. So if you here on help and then you click submit a ticket, that is going to open a support window where you are able to contact me. So thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye bye.